Let me welcome you all to this uh, meeting of uh, defense ministers from the countries uh, contributing uh, to our resolute support mission in Afghanistan. In the last six months, NATO's ISAF mission has concluded and Afghanistan has taken full responsibility for its own security. We have launched uh, our resolute support mission to train, advise and assist the Afghan security forces. We have continued our support to the financial sustainment of the Afghan security forces and we have agreed to enhance long-term enduring partnership with Afghanistan, including through uh, a civilian-led presence. The security situation remains difficult, as we have seen, for example, early this week in Kabul. We commend the professionalism of the Afghan National Defense and Security Forces and we honor their sacrifices. We continue to stand with them and support their future development. Today we will discuss the progress of our resolute support mission. We will also assess the current security and political situation and we will look uh, to the future to how we will evolve our resolute support mission, to how we will, we will continue to support the Afghan security forces through capacity building and institutional development. Together, NATO, our partners and the government of Afghanistan have achieved a great deal. The future of Afghanistan lies in the hands of the Afghan people and we remain committed to supporting them every step of the way. And now I thank the representatives of the media who have been here uh, and uh, we close this part of the meeting, the public uh, part. So, thank you.